Hi, you're face to face with Shell. In today's video, I'm going to keep with the theme of sort of lightheartedness of having fun with burns. Now, I'm not taking away the seriousness of what happened to me or what anyone else has gone through. It's just the way I have learned to cope with it. And there has been a few scenarios that have been quite funny. Um, that has helped me go through and as I said it's the way I cope it's it's my sense of humour obviously not, not every day is like this but I just want to bring a bit of fun to the videos in this one I want to tell you about when I applied to be the witch of Wookiehole Wookiehole is a beautiful village down in Somerset in England if you get a chance, go along. It's absolutely beautiful. They have an attraction there of caves and all sorts of things. And I'll actually put a link to the Wukuho Caves and the resort in the, the description of this video and on my website as well. We had went down there for a holiday to Cornwall, which I've said before we absolutely love. And we'd stopped off in Wukuho for a couple of nights because it's quite a long drive from where I stay in central Scotland. When we were leaving, they had asked us if we wanted to sign up for the newsletter, which I did. Then when we were on holiday in Cornwall, we got a, a message through saying that they were looking for a new witch which is someone obviously who's dressed up and they, they entertain the people when they come along to Wiki Home. So I decided, yeah, I'm going to apply for this. Unfortunately, I couldn't actually go for the auditions, um, but I did apply and you had to send your photographs and you had to wear what you would wear to work. Um, so obviously, dress as a witch. Um, I just basically wore my own clothes. You had to then, obviously, in addition, one of the things you had to do was to tell a, a story. And I decided my story would incorporate my burns. Now, we, we all know of what happened to these poor people years and years ago who were burned as witches if they were found, if they were accused and found guilty of it. But I thought, okay. I'm going to incorporate this because it was a witch I was applying for. So my story went a little like this. That I had been... The, the, the villagers up in Scotland had found out that I, will, I was accused of being a witch and they then found me and tried me and found me guilty of being a witch. They then tied me to the stake and lit the pyre they hadn't tied me that well and my trusted friends threw my broom to me and by the, the, the power of magic, because they hadn't really tied me to the stake that well anyway, I was able to fly away and I escaped down to Wukuho and here I was in the sanctuary of Wukuho. What I was going to say though, the, to explain the burns, was that unfortunately the burns, the, the flames did actually get a bit of me. I was able to use my magic to heal them just enough so that I would get down to Wuku Hole. I hope you've enjoyed that story. Um, I really wish that I'd actually managed to go to the auditions. It was just work commitments that I'd, I wasn't able to go down at the time. Um, Chris always said, he says, oh, I think you would have got that job. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you once again to all of you who have subscribed. I really hope you're all enjoying what are the, the small series of the, the videos on having fun with burns, as I call it. Please head over to my website. There's loads more information and I will put a link in the description to the video to the website. Also, please, it'd be so appreciated if you would give me a like and a share. And if you haven't subscribed, please, it would be great if you subscribed. Please remember to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. Thank you once again for watching. Bye.